Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I said I'd be filming a few videos today, so if you see me in another video dressed exactly the same with exactly the same makeup, then that is why. Um, I want to get these filmed while I've still got a little bit of light left. I know it's not the best lighting that I've ever had in the whole entire world. It is probably half past two in the afternoon and it is raining outside and it's December tomorrow so I'm fighting against all the elements and time so um, this is going to be a Cass Kidston haul something that I will do very very rarely um, however I am in love with Cass Kidston and have been for many years now um, well, since probably since the age of about 20, I'm now 27. Um, it's been, it's, I've just loved it. I've always had stuff and like, I remember moving in last year and it's only when I was moving all of my stuff that I noticed how many Cass Kidston items I had down to like makeup bags, towels, cups, everything. I think even my lanyard for work, if I can find it, no I can't, um, is a Cath Kidston lanyard with my ID badge on it as well. So um, earlier this month I went to Cardiff with my mum and she is equally the same. She loves Cath Kidston. We popped in. Um, I'd been in the day before with Vicky. Um, her channel on here is There's Beauty and Simplicity and nothing really sort of ca caught my eye. I thought, oh, it's a bit rubbish. And then I went in the next day. Obviously, they hadn't put anything new in, but everything seemed to jump out at me. I was like, oh, I'll have that. Oh, I'll have that as well. And it just seemed like I wanted to, like, I didn't want to spend a lot of money. Um, I did spend um, a decent amount. Um, but it was all things that I thought were worthwhile and good purchases. So I'm just going to crack on. So I've been rambling on for too long now. Um, I saw this, uh, I think it's a beach towel for the size of it. It's quite a large towel and it's in like the blue. It's quite a summery sort of pattern. It's light blue with clouds all over it. So that's that. It's really, really big and I'm trying to find the price tag here. So yeah, it, it's a bath sheet which is 100 centimetres by 150 centimetres which is really big because I find the next size down is too small um, not to wrap around my body, that's fine. It's just a lot shorter in length and comes higher than the knee, so I don't feel like I'm covering a lot of my body. And if I want to put it around my hair, because my hair is so long, it pokes out the bottom of the towel, like a normal sized towel, and then it drips all down my back and it's just a bit not very nice. So this was £42 down to £32, which some of you might think, uh, what, you spent £32 on a towel. Let me tell you something. I have bought some Cath Kidston towels in the past, years and years ago, and they still look brand new to this day. And they have been washed, used, washed, used, down the beach, on a boil wash, and taken on holiday, and they still look like brand new. So I know that this is £32 well spent and it's going to last for a long time to come and who doesn't need a big big towel. Then I also saw, this was from the sales section as well, it's a double duvet set and it comes with the pillowcases as well. So it's just this flowery pattern on one side and then a stripy pattern on the other side. So in essence, you are getting like two duvet covers for the price of one because one time you can put it on like the stripy side and then wash it and then when you put it on next, you can put it on the flowery side to give a completely different look to your bedroom. So this is a picture of what it looks like on the back. So that's it all made up to be all flowery. And you can see that they folded it over to give the stripy side as well. So you get what I mean. You can get two for the price of one. And this was £55, reduced down to £38, and then reduced down again to £27. So you're getting um, a duvet and two pillowcases for £27 from Cath Kisden, which I think is an absolute bargain of the month. 
Um, I've currently got Kath Kidston on my bed at the moment. Again, I've had this for absolutely years. I just want to show you like the quality. That's what I've got on my bed at the moment. It's not double-sided like the one that I've got. So that's for one of my pillows. And then for the under pillow, I've got this pattern on one of my under pillows. And then on my second under pillow, like on the other sides, it's a double bed. Um, I've got this pattern, all Kath Kidston. And then the actual duvet cover is in the stripy one, like I showed you to match the pillows. And I've had that for years, probably well over five, six years now, um, for either Christmas or my birthday or something. And I paid well over the odds, pushing about 80 quid, I would say. So this is, you know, really, really good value for money, 27 pounds. And I know it's gonna wash well and wear well, cause this, the one that I've got on now still looks brand new. So excited. I know it's a bit more of like a summery, summery themed, but it's, um, that's how my house rolls because I like bright colors. So I love the idea of putting this on and climbing into bed tonight and just going, mm, that's really nice. It's such a satisfying feeling to get into a bed with clean new bed sheets. Yes. And then just two little items now uh, ready for Christmas. I got these little Christmas decorations, mainly for Holly, because I thought they were cute. They remind me of some Christmas decorations that, you know, like um, older people sit there and knit and then they sell in like little tabletop sales in the local village, Faith or something like that for Christmas. That's what they reminded me of. So the I got a little Santa, um, a snowman with a hat and a robin with some dangly legs. I think these are so cute and I think Holly will absolutely love them. And these were £12, which is insane. When you think about, um, you know, you could go into Poundland and buy 12 Christmas decorations for £12, whereas I've come out with three, so that's £4 per decoration. But... I don't care because I know that they're gonna last for a long time. It's not something that can break easily and they can be packed away easily as well. So they're gonna be good for Holly when she grows up as well. So that's those. And then for my love of tea um, and love of Kath Kidston mugs, I had to get the, this year's um, Christmas mug. So these are only £6.50, which I think is a bargain in itself. Um, it's a really decent sized cup of tea. If I'm having a cup of tea, it has to be this size. Anything smaller, um, I'm literally boiling in the kettle as soon as I finish my last sip in that cup because it's just not enough for me. Um, but on here, you've got some like Christmas trees, some like deer in pink and blue, a little blue Christmas tree, a Santa, a big deer, um, and I think that's it. What else have we got? I think we've got some mountains, a present, and then there's a set of presents there. It's just all a lot of like Christmas related things. Um, so I just thought, yes, I want that because I had one a few years ago and haven't purchased one since because they've been too similar. But this one is very different to the one that they had last year. So that's why I bought it. So I'm looking forward to decorating my Christmas tree tonight, having a shower and using my new towel, getting into bed with my new Kath Kidston uh, bed sheets, and then settling down with a nice mug of tea or hot chocolate. I might push the boat out and have a hot chocolate. So that'll be lovely. So yep, that's my Kath Kidston haul. I think, have I got the receipt here? How much did that all come to? £77.55 pence for some very good quality items. I love Kath Kidston because I know that the quality is there and it's my sort of style of things as well. So that was my little, you know, treat to myself because I rarely get to go to Cardiff um, anymore that often and that's the nearest Kath Kidston store to me so yeah um, do you like Kath Kidston and have you bought any of their Christmas things or anything in the sale um, I would like to know 
Uh, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and click subscribe wherever it may be um, to see more videos like this in the future. Um, I can certainly try and shop in Catechism more often if that is something that you wanted to see. Um, but yeah, other than that, happy weekend, everyone. Bye.